Hey everyone, how are you doing? Well, today I'm going to show you a mint eye tutorial and, and it has a lot of versions. You can actually do it with different colors and different types. Well, I'm going to show you one with mint plus brown color. You can have this look whenever uh, you want to go out. It's some special occasion which is in the morning or a date night or even when you're going clubbing or prom, you just want to, you're too bored of all those dark colors and you want to do something different. So this look is perfect for you. Okay, so a uh, big wave and then we proceed. So I'll be showing you whatever palette uh, of shade I'm using in this way. Well, I'm pointing out at the color right now. So you can see I'm using a light brown color. I'm using it as a base on my eyes and uh, don't forget to use primer before you put anything on your eyes. Primer or concealer or even foundation would do. So I'm using this color as a base and I'm putting it all over my lid. Actually over my lid as well. Just to create that color. the lid and make sure that it's only on the lid and not going above otherwise it will be a little not so great and don't worry if it's not that perfect and all because we'll be blending it out with the fingers and fingers I think are best for this because it's got the shimmer and all that but you can use brush if you're okay with it or if you have the correct kind of a brush and this is not from India but you can get similar stuff if I find something I will be putting it down below in the description box you can check it there now I'll be using a little darker tone the one I'm pointing at to just put on the crease and blend it out blend the color the mint color a little bit but you have to be careful about the fallouts as even I had to face the same thing but you really have to be careful and if you're not comfortable go for a lighter tone or just add that color before you went with for the mint eye and then you add this one I think that will be better but I'm doing it this way you can just do whatever you feel with ease in and I'm blending it out so that the color is put together and it's not like the colors are just rough, roughly outlined or something like that. And then I'll be adding a little more uh, mint color again just to, as you can see it's got lightened up but I'll brighten up again. And doing the same thing on the other eye and as I am a right handed person, left side is a problem for me, so I have to be really careful on that. Now I am using this more dark color, coffee color actually, look at that, on the outer corner of my eye just to create that smoky effect. And I think black also goes really perfectly well with this, black looks even better but I'm showing the brown one today. So I'm dabbing it all over my eyelid, uh, outer corners. And you just have to dab over the lid also a little bit on the crease, the outer crease. And you don't have to be perfect because we'll be blending it out. And if you're not perfect or if you're having problems with blending, then I would suggest you just dab on the lid and then blend and then it will go a little up uh, upwards and then blend again like tapping it 
I think that will be done easily, but it'll be a little time consuming. But if you could do it like I am doing, you should go ahead with it. So I'm done tabbing using generous amount. Yeah. And then taking the same fluffy brush and blending it out. Just make sure that all the colors are blended out together. And it's also like blending is like the source, the whole medicine for our eye makeup thing. So enough has been said about it. I need not say everything. And I'm doing this with my left, a uh, left hand. So yeah, I was a bit doubtful and very slow. You can highlight your brow bone as well, but I haven't done it because I'm just showing you the basic mint eye then i'm taking this shimmery white and i'm going in my inner corners because mint eye goes well with white you can actually have used white on the crease to blend it would have looked good but as i'm using in the inner corner i didn't use it there and then i'll be curling my eyes moving on to the next round a level I'm taking a lot of time actually and now I'm putting mascara not so well and I make very funny faces while doing this so please ignore my face. I'm taking a very good amount of time so you are probably bored but I would like to tell you that you should take a lot of time doing your eye makeup because that's the most trickiest part and if done perfectly I think that's the only part which shows and which pops out and makes you look really beautiful and pretty so I think you should always take your time and if you're not good at something just practice just, just get a cheap product from any market and just keep trying whenever you are at home and whenever you have time I'm sure you will get used to it and you will perfect it with time and after this we will be uh, lining our eyes You can actually use eyeshadow to line your eyes uh, in the outer waterline. Just mix a couple of uh, colors which you used or you can use the mint eye mixed with black. I think it looks great. I used to do that all the time but tried to skip it today because it wasn't a big occasion or something. And as I've got a little mascara on my under eyes and all that, you a little tip, you have to just get it dried after getting it dried use an earbud and clean it up it will come out but you shouldn't touch it when it's you know not uh, very dried off and then i'm using this mint eye again just to touch up before i use eyeliner and then i'm using my white eyeliner as you know i'm such a big fan of it just it just makes my eyes look so big and so pretty i mean i just love it i'm in love with it and then we are going to the other eye now i'm lining my eye eyes and this is another favorite part for me i have so many favorites what can i say not actually making a winged eyeliner because as it is we are going for a fresh cool tone look so i'm not actually going all dramatic and crazy wing eye kind of thing
and that's it i have already done my face makeup i don't think i have to show that to you and i hope you enjoy this hi guys well i hope you enjoyed my tutorial and if you have any questions please comment down below for watching i'll see you soon I woke up